And so this is completely unacceptable. It is also anathema to Islam that reveres Jesus, that sees the gospel as the holy book of God, and that the most mentioned and revered woman is the mother of Jesus, the Virgin Mary, in the Quran. So these Muslims are acting beyond the bounds of faith as well as beyond the restrictions of democracy. Astra, you know, I, I, it seems like we talk about this a lot, but when the Sri Lankan bombings happened 10 weeks ago, I thought this is really going to... A place of deification, you know. Love, and, well, love. And, and love beyond anything else. But if you're probably curious, why is the cross under attack, right? Yes, why? It's because this Quran that I have right here, in the first chapter, at the last sentence that we have, we say that we have to stay on the straight path. What the Saudi interpretation and now governments like Qatar and Turkey have added is we have to stay on the straight path and not depart from it like the Jews and the Christians have done. Because they say that thinking of Jesus as the Son of God is like polytheism. And that is ultimately worse than murder, they say. Mm. And so that is why you have this attack so on there's the a, so symbol. There's a, so there's a warping of the interpretation by the Wahhabists? Is that how you see it, Dr. Ahmed, especially justifying the slaughter of Christians in the Middle East. Obviously, you've seen it in Iraq and Syria uh, and Pakistan and, and other countries throughout the Middle East. Is it is it that, that Wahhabist that kind of view? In, that kind of interpretation, which is completely anathema to, I'm a Muslim uh, child who was uh, educated in a Christian school. My parents are in the 80s and they had a Christian education. So that's completely anathema to the teachings of Islam. It also is asking uh, for Muslims to take actions into their own hands and then persecute for somebody's beliefs when Islam says everyone has a right to a free will, a right to reject Islam, to reject the truth of God in any way. So these Muslims are acting beyond the bounds. Now, there are some bright